I think China will become the world leader in AI. We have all the key ingredients to become the world leader. We have the largest number of people working in AI in terms of the research. We have probably the largest AI educated population in the world. So the number of AI researchers are about three times than US. So the second ingredient is the data. The AI is largely data driven. So China has the largest application market for AI. In the foreseeable future, the most of the AI valued data will come from China. We will take this advantage because the world leader in AI. The third point is the AI infrastructure. With all the data we need to commute, we need to transmit them in terms of the infrastructure. China has the world most advanced data infrastructure. I would not count China out of anything. The record of innovation, the creativity, the fearlessness and taking risks, I think all point in, the, in that, that direction. There's a lot of uncertainty in where AI is at, but I think the ingredients are, are all there. I've been so impressed at the level of innovation and creativity and risk taking. We're going to see innovations in these irresponsible tech coming from China as a result of that. I think this year's conference is really about large models. It's a really hot topic in the research community as well. People are thinking how to take in use of these large models capability for different applications. I quite agree with what Huawei's strategy is try to bring the general AI vertical industry. The first key is to make sure that, certainly for the time being, you keep the human in the loop. Where people have gotten into trouble is when they just take it on face value and don't check. With the incredible growth in the China economy, you've got both the increased pressure from that growth to address some of these issues, but you also have the capacity.